Royals? Y'all are tuned in to Queen Talk with Sanchez Blackman. I'm here live with the legendary Rodney Perry. How you doing? I get that word, legendary? Yeah, you legendary, That's Rodney. because I won't quit. Because <laughs> you won't quit. That's what make you legendary, wow, goddammit. I'll tell you. We're talking about Johnson's family vacation. And Medea's, what, big they happy family. family. Okay. You know, Why you before, silly? Though? Why you silly? Though? Before. You, you got jewelry in your hand? I do. Yeah, you know, I feel like a certified queen tonight. Like baby. What's up? Like, you got to tell, I don't make me feel like that, Rodney. <laughs> Look, before you say I do. Mm -hmm. Play, man. I just did my first play. How was my it? My whole career. You know what, Sanchez, it was crazy because I really stayed away from plays because, you know, the, the, the time investment has never made sense to me. Because, you know, I, I go out and make what they pay me on a weekend doing stand-up, and I love to do stand-up. But it's something about acting and Acting that way is very similar to what we do at stand up, uh -huh. but it's also like running with a team, you know. And, and I'm, a, I'm an old athlete, so you know, it's, it's good to have a camaraderie. You know, we, we operate on the island as comedians, you, yeah. it's just you, you make all your decisions, but it, it's something to be conscious and uh, cognizant of your fellow actors. Yeah. And uh, being a part of play requires you to do that. You know, them words you use, I'm going to have to go look this shit up. <laughs> but no, though, so, you know, the difference between, you know, being in the movie and actually having a live crowd yes. acting. Is it complicated when you hear little giggles and shit? Like, do you want to say, damn, they need to be quiet? It's worse when you don't. Oh, wow. You know, because, like, like if you if you, if you you hit a spot, like, in stand-up, you can address it. Yeah. In stand-up, you're like, oh, y'all didn't get that? What the? <laughs> you know, in a play, you really kind of don't. It's kind of some, it's kind of some... Some some do's and don'ts in play in the play world that that I really kind of didn't know, and and you know what I really I learned more than anything is there's a play hustle, like all the play actors had merchandise and books and stuff they were slanging. I'm Are like, you serious? I was like, what well, my I, well, I ain't got no money. <laughs> I need to have some stuff I hit a lobby, you know. Well, yeah, I did not know that. I just oh. thought they just go back in the back, take them wigs off and mics and go. Exactly, on. that's what I thought. Oh wow, wrong, 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 wrong for us. Damn. They slang, That's they slang in books and everything. It was dope. I can picture the books and stuff. I can yeah. picture that. So you only got one son, Rodney. Yeah. What would you tell Five him? Five girls, one son. Five girls, one son. Mm -hmm. So there's, there's one meat slang in the house besides you. Yeah. So I'm just saying, what would you tell your son before he say, I do? Well, what I tell my son before he say, I do is, is you know, ask the tough questions, you know. Uh, you know, it was crazy to be a part of a play that really addressed marriage. I'm 21 years married, and watching that play, I still would, like, I wish we had went through marriage counseling. Oh, wow. Because, I mean, you find out stuff later on in the marriage, you know, you know, probably 80% of women have been molested some sort of way, some way, shape, or form. You, you may or may not know that about your spouse. Yeah. You know, I mean, that's not something people just say, you know, you know so... That would be some great information to have going into a relationship. That that speaks to sexual hang up, that speaks to stuff that she do and don't do. Yeah. So it, it, it's stuff that that, that that could affect your relationship for years and years to come. And so before I would tell my son, before he said I do, to make sure that he does. You know, I, I think you can get married too soon yeah. and and you're not ready to really to do. You're not ready to do. Right. That makes you know? sense. And so be ready to do it if you say I do. Hey man to that. Hey man to that. Man, I'm gonna have to find me a young old nigga because these young dudes ain't ready. You, you, you are so pretty. You, 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 you got skinny. I'm so sick of this one. You gotta be between 28 and 36. I'll take you in. That's my age range. 28 and 36. 28 and 36. That's Look at my, my age, low key. Anyway, so I'm gonna move on. This career is made of tons of moments. Uh, uh, it, it's, 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 it's it's moments like winning the Bear the Black Comedy Competition. That was a, a huge milestone. It put me on the national stage. It made it so my peers knew who I was. That was that was huge. Playing the, the Apollo, although I didn't have a great set, mm -hmm. the Apollo Theater was a big moment for me. I just remember like I remember thinking my whole career was hinging on that moment. And then now, 20 years down the line, I know that no one thing makes or breaks you. No one thing. You just got to keep stay the course. And stay steady and you'll be fine. Or or, or the moment I'm, I'm in a comedy club one day and this, this comedian Tony Royster, he was the vet, I was a young recruit. And he was like, Brian, why are you on stage with all that stuff in your pocket? 
<laughs> what you had, Harry Potter? Right? I had all kind of shit. <laughs> He said, man, it's distracting, man. To this day, I'm not on I'm never on stage with anything in my pocket. Wow. On the So my last question is, if you could be a superhero for one day, where would it be? Who would it be? I don't if, know. if I could be a superhero, oh wow! You know, I mean, easy call is Superman, but Superman is an alien. I mean, we, I mean, we don't even know if Superman have a penis. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we don't know that. But why gotta be Superman? I'm saying that that's the that's the quick call. He's strong and all that. Batman is just a regular dude. Uh, Spider Man need buildings. Uh, I would like to be like the Flash, or somebody that can run real fast. But I wouldn't be no superhero. I would just, just, well, I would just flex it on like a football field. Or something. You couldn't run at night, right? You couldn't run at well, night. Why can't run? You dog jacket doggy. You. I can't. You, I can't. You I, that, that's my name, the Blur. The, <laughs> that's even better. The Blur. The blur yeah. Really? Okay. I would be my superhero. Would be come quick. Come quick. Yeah, because I, I, I come quicker than everybody. <laughs> okay, I'll take that one. I'll take that Because I ain't trying to be in there all day. <laughs> you know what? As long as you don't have no more kids, that's all right with me. Let me tell you, I, I already talked to my wife about this. I, she said, I, well, she ain't going to have no more. But, but when I'm 60, I'm going to have an, another set of kids that ain't going to see me the whole life. Why you playing Rodney? My mom was 29 years old. My stepdad was 68. And he still was able to make two more children. Oh, oh yeah, you can have, I mean, as long as you're shooting, you can, you, you can hit, you can hit, you can hit the basket. So you want to deal with dirty diapers while somebody changes? No, 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 I, I ain't never changed no diapers. I don't, I don't, I'm, I'm old school dad. I'm glad I found out something about it. He ain't never changed no diapers. I don't do that. I, I play sleep. <laughs> oh, my God. It's bad enough you got dogs jumping in and out your garbage. How the dog doing? That dog ran away. Oh, uh, I believe that you let dog, that. I'm gonna tell. I'm telling your wife. I believe you let that dog out. I wasn't even home when it happened. Cause I, I'm, I'm, you know, they they get these dogs and I end up taking care. Of them. So yeah, my brother dog is in the house now. That dog is the maniac. He, oh, your he little dog. brother. Yeah. <laughs> little Charlie. Y'all, uh, I'm gonna wrap this up because you know I'm gonna be in the family. My last name gonna be Sanchez Perry. Then just think about my whole name, Sanchez Ruby Lee Perry. Ruby Lee. Yes. Ruby Lee. Stop. Ruby Lee. <laughs> That's what he's going to be saying at our wedding. So, I'm going to be in the family. Y'all need, need some light-skinned people, nigga. Y'all need some light-skinned people. I love to have you in the family. I'm a fan. You a and friend? I'm a friend. I'm a friend. No, you a mentor, man. So, thank you so much, man. What, what, what is a mentor? You know what? what a lot of people don't know. Because, like, you helped my comedy career. If it wasn't for your class and you, like, make another choice. And <laughs> Make another choice. <laughs> That shit made me think so quick on my feet, it don't make no sense. So when somebody fuck them in the crowd, if I got a head, bam, 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 make another choice. So when I be talking in conversations, you know, with certain people, I be like, make another choice, bitch, they don't sound right. <laughs> He sound like a complete fuck boy. Make another choice. Make another choice. Make another wow. choice. And that. you got to be confident in your choice, and that's important. And hey, you know what? You know, just be, be confident in your dopeness. Yeah. You know, I mean, I mean you know, I want make it. Make if, if you can trust your ability to make decisions, you always you always in a great space. Yeah. I tell my wife all the time, I ain't afraid to be wrong. He done. He done. Thank you so much, Rodney Perry. Love you. Love you too.